Article 13. Everyone has the right to freedom of movement and residence within the borders of each state, and has the right to leave any country, including his own, and to return to this country. Articles 2.5 and 7. Everyone is entitled to all the rights and freedoms set forth in this declaration, without distinction of any kind, such as race, color, sex, language, religion, political or other opinion, national or social origin, property, birth or other statuses. No one shall be subjected to torture or to cruel, inhumane or degrading treatment or punishment. All are equal before the law and are entitled without any discrimination to equal protection of the law. All are entitled to equal protection against any discrimination in violation of this declaration and against any incident to such discrimination. All of these have things in common with what's going on in the world today. Racial profiling, police brutality, discrimination. It happens every day all over the world, even in airports and on airplanes. The most recent reported case of this was on April 13, when an Asian doctor was asked to give up his seat on an airplane. When asked to give up his seat, he politely refused, resulting in him being violently removed from the airplane, leaving him with a concussion. This is just one of the many cases of unnecessary violence against innocent citizens of color. Typically, when people see Muslims or any other people that wear articles of clothing relating to their culture, such as hijabs or burqas, TSA used racial profiling to determine if that person should be allowed on the airplane or not. All of these unnecessary incidents are direct violation of the four articles of the UDHR and probably even more. I wonder if you can.